I couldn't think of any place that we'd rather be than here with you two today. And we're so glad and we're so honored to have you a part of our family, Priscilla. We look forward to many more occasions where we get to celebrate each other as family and have a good time and enjoy one another. <laughs> I remember the day Priscilla called me to tell me about this amazing man that she met at work. <laughs> and then I met you and I realized, you know, that everything was true. You're a, a wonderful man. She's very lucky and so are you. I know from experience, you know, having had this girl in my life for 17 years, she is truly amazing. You're one lucky guy. Good morning, babe. It's a few short hours. You'll become Mrs. Priscilla Wright, making me the happiest man in the world. Um, I can't put into words how excited I am to, to make you my wife and to begin the journey of life together. enjoyed you, Priscilla, from the first day. Also, we get to see a, a baseball game, so. <laughs> but Priscilla, I, I gotta say this. Always joke with my nephew, you have to be the most uh, luckiest woman in the world to actually uh, grab a young man of, of this stature. Uh, and I don't want to, <laughs> I don't want to lift him up too high, but most of all, you married Mr. Wright. <laughs> I'm David's father, and unlike uh, my brother-in-law David, I'm not going to lift him up too high because I've known him his whole life. <laughs> God could not have created a more perfect union than he is in my mind, than these two. I'll continue to pray for you and bless you. God bless you for the next 100 years. A toast to you. Priscilla, we met almost four years ago, and in that time I've seen the positive impact you've had on Dave. I'm glad you came into his life and you truly are a special person. I mean, anyone that can convince Dave that he doesn't need to eat a steak every night, <laughs> has to be a special. <laughs> Priscilla was God's special gift to me. I prayed for a little girl and I was blessed beyond measure. We called her an old soul because she was mature beyond her age. Always the voice of reason. She has a perfect match in David. And I see he makes her happy. And that's half of the battle and I thank you for that because David, you got a handful. 